this prison as it has run here for decades. English 998, English 99B, those are both college prep classes. Social psychology, English 101, which is intro to composition, and then 102 is introduction to literature. There's stereotypes about women, but then the stereotypes about blackness makes interesting things with black women versus white women. So that has been looked at, and we can talk about that more. So depending on the context and where you are, your in-group, out-group is going to differ. You go into a car lot, mm -hmm. and the salesman is not paying you any attention. And even though you come in to buy the car, that, that out group is so powerful even to that person who may not can intellectualize what's happening to her. What about Aunt Glossman? Is she innocent? Is her death the slaughter of the innocent? What is she doing when she's raising this child? She's being overprotective. Protecting them from something. She's not protecting him out of her own uh, I used to teach Miami. middle school in East Oakland at the lowest performing middle school in Oakland, and I lost a lot of students over the course of two years. I come in here and I don't see inmates. I constantly refer to them as students. I caught myself earlier talking about their dorms. To get into a classroom environment and, a, and to talk on an intellectual basis with other human beings is different than being out on the, you know, on the yard in prison. Click, click, tick, tock of doing time. What, what's wrong with this picture? How is it that, that people don't understand what's going on here outside of the system? And one, one of the things I love about my job, like I've joked about this in the past, but it sometimes feels like we're really running a study abroad program for clueless white people. Because really what we're doing is, on the one hand, you know, we're running, officially we're educating the inmates, right? But really what we're also doing is we're bringing all these folks in from the academy, from all these different, you know, departments at all these different local institutions, and they're becoming educated about the prison system and the criminal justice system in a way that they never would have been before. The students are going to have to leave at about quarter to eight to be back at the cells by eight.